for your last whole one year at IIT Madras, uh, like uh, your third and fourth semester, you will be earning more than 50k per month already, even before getting your job. So how great that is. So that's why I am sharing this information with you. And I'll be also uh, putting some proofs, okay, like exactly how much, uh, you know, stipend they were offering during our time. So at the end of this video, I'll be sharing all those uh, documents with you, like uh, with proofs. So you can have a look at them and uh, I'll be also sharing you some JDs, okay. So Hi guys, so in today's video, I'll be telling you like how you can get a stipend of even more than 60k, 70k during your MTech at IIT Madras. And this information is very, very exclusive. You won't find it anywhere else. No one is going to be telling you this until and unless you get your admission at IIT Madras and Department of CSE and department itself announces it during your uh, MTV project, uh, you know, uh, uh, phase. So uh, please uh, pay attention to each and every detail and you will be surprised like how beneficial it can be for you to get your admission for MTech at IIT Madras in the CSE department, okay? So now uh, the thing is like uh, we also uh, told you the same thing in previous videos as well like the cost structure for MTech CSE at IIT Madras is divided into two parts. First is your coursework and second is your uh, project, M MTP uh, project. So the thing is like uh, ideally you are supposed to finish uh, eight courses of yours in your first two semesters and uh, last two semesters like third and fourth is, fourth is reserved for your MTech uh, project. So in third semester you will be doing your MTP phase one and in fourth semester you will be doing MTP phase two. So that's the basic structure. Now, uh, in order to, you know, start with uh, MTP phase one in your third semester. So somewhere in mid of second semester or like uh, around last few weeks of the second semester, uh, there will be, uh, you know, information circulated with you and you are supposed to choose your MTech guide. So usually what a student does is that uh, they choose, they try to choose the guide from department itself. So for which like whatever the faculties you have in your department like uh, you can approach them and it's generally like there are multiple ways for a faculty to uh, you know choose you like few uh, prefer like first come first serve and for few others it might be like merit based like they might consider uh, your pointers in few courses which are relevant to them like algorithms or uh, programming lab something like that and uh, for other professors there might be uh, you know rush like for gpu programming there a professor uh, rupes nasre so like uh, most of the people try to you know get mtp under him and so many other circumstances are there like for uh, data science and all those projects as well so now uh, the catch here is that uh, from uh, last one or two years what iit madras csc department has done is like they introduced industry oriented projects okay you might be uh, already knowing that there is a research park in the iit madras so with uh, you know the cooperation of uh, a research park as well as few outside uh, industries so what they have done is like uh, they come up with few projects which are industry oriented and you can you know uh, uh, instead of doing your mtp inside the csc department you can choose to, uh, you know, work on those projects as part of your uh, MTP uh, project. And uh, now what is the benefit of doing these projects instead of doing uh, your MTP under a professor in the CSE department is that you get some extra perks, okay? So if you are doing uh, these industry projects, then they'll be paying you extra stipend. You are going to get this 12,400 as well as they'll pay you some extra money like uh, some some companies pay even 15k 60k or 45k 20k it depends like company to company but uh, minimum uh, this pay scale is like it starts from 15k per month so uh, now the benefit is like uh, even though if you are uh, going to choose your mtp under the department still you will be paying uh, you know almost uh, same level of attention same kind of work it might vary a little bit uh, like if you are doing an industry project you might have to report every week and uh, you might have to do some real work you cannot you know excuse uh, or all those things but it is very very helpful and uh, you know great opportunity for those people who are like a little bit interested in putting some extra efforts and want to uh, make some extra money so uh, just uh, you know 
assume uh, this situation okay for your last whole one year at iit madras uh, like uh, your third and fourth semester you will be earning more than 50k per month already even before getting your job so how great that is so that's why i am sharing this information with you and i'll be also uh, putting some proofs okay like exactly how much uh, you know stipend they were offering during our time so at the end of this video i will be sharing all those uh, documents with you like uh, with proofs so you can have a look at them and i will be also sharing you some jds okay so you can have a idea of like what exactly is required for uh, getting your mtp at those companies so you can prepare accordingly and uh, yeah this is a unique opportunity which you will not be getting at any other iits okay so that's the great advantage of uh, you know getting your mtech done from iit madras so that's what i say and uh, yeah keep learning and keep improving yourself until the day comes okay so thank you yeah see bye now so let's see there is this company called akai k so this is their skills and experience what they are expecting from you and this is their uh, remuneration they will be paying you 45k per month and their location is iit madras research park so similarly there is this company called tata, tata communications so they are also having multiple projects like this is their one project they are again paying 45k stipend per month and this is the required skill set like machine learning graph learning python pytorch statistics deep learning etc this is there again another project so similarly they will be having multiple projects and there is this one another company called cyber security works this is also uh, iitm research park company so they will be paying you 15k stipend and this is their required skill set so again there is this company called uh, Prodept. This is also a ITM uh, company. So this is their stipend 50k per month, and this is the basic skill set. And like they are, they are also having multiple projects like this AI for sustainability and telco organization. Again, they will be paying you 50k stipends. So these are the required skill set. So similarly, there are multiple companies which you can choose. So. Yeah, and uh, if you need any of these JDs in detail, then I'll mention my LinkedIn below there in description. So please feel free to get in touch with me there and I'll share them with you.